Here's a quick video to show you how you can activate uh, the parent portal in iStation so that you can give your parents access to the information or the data that's stored in iStation for their students. So they'll have the reports for it, um, both the reading and the math assessments. They'll also be given resources to work with their um, children at home based on those ICIP results. So the way you do that is from your classroom tab, you would look on the left-hand side and click on parent portal letters. When you click that, it's going to populate if you scroll down, you will see all of your students are listed underneath here and you're going to click select all or you can do individual students as well. And then you wanna make sure that you go all the way to the bottom and you hit update parent portal settings. This is like the save button on iStation. You'll know that it's done correctly if you get this green success bar that pops up um, at the top. And then it takes you right here to number three and it's highlighted in blue, which lets you know it's a hyperlink. So you can click on this and this will give you the option to now print letters for your students so they can have their username and password for the parent portal um, for their parents to be able to log in. So you can do this a couple of different ways. You can select all or you can select one. I think selecting one might be helpful because you can get a PDF version of this letter. So I'm going to select it and click create parent letters. Um, this notice does come in English and Spanish. So for each student, you'll head over here to the right and click print letters. So I know we don't have students sitting in our classroom that you can hand them this letter. So when you click print, you'll likely want to make sure it's going to default to whatever your printer is, but you might change this to, sorry, it's loading the preview for a second. You'll want to change this to save as PDF. So once you do that, you can save this on your computer. That way you can upload it and send it through Clash Dojo or through an email um, or whatever works for you. Um, just keep in mind that these letters are personalized for each student. They each have a different um, username and password for their parents to be able to activate the parent portal. So um, that'll be important. The other thing is if you select all students, if you don't want to go one by one for each of the students in your class, you can also take snips. So using the snipping tool, you can just take a picture, you know, draw the box around it, and then save those pictures and then upload them again the same way through Class Dojo or um, email or whatever platform you're using to communicate with families. So just wanted to share that. And then again, they have lots of information for parents on that parent portal. So if you have families asking, that's a great uh, tool for you. Thank you.